Mr. Odeji is brought in a car by his family to the Synagogue Church of All Nations. He suffers from inability to walk, lying flat in a car because of excruciating pain caused by a spinal cord injury. You can see the expression of agony on the man's face as they carry him out of the car into the wheelchair. In deep sorrow and distress, the man's family wheel him to the emergency section of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, looking in faith unto our Lord Jesus Christ to have mercy and heal their brother. Jesus never says no to those who ask for healing according to his word, because his will for us is to be physically healed and spiritually saved. God's power and effectiveness have not changed. Let's hear from Mr. John Odeji. Please help me, help me. Oh, I'm a sinner. Please, I'm going to be a sinner. I'm dying. I want to walk, man of God. Man of God, please help me. Help me, my back. My stomach, my back. Oh, help me. What is the cause of the problem? Can you please tell me the cause? Huh? He just woke up and he said his back started paining him when I went to see him. Jesus is the same yesterday, today and forever. His power and effectiveness are even greater today because he can be in all places at all times by his spirit. Healing is taking place. As it was, so it is. Jesus Christ healed the sick and still heals today. The man of God, Prophet T.B. Joshua, is praying for Mr. Odeji in the name of Jesus Christ for the glory of God. Save me, man of God. I stop on my back. Save me. Save me, man of God. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Rise up and walk. To God be the glory. Jesus Christ has done it again. As spirit-filled words are spoken to Mr. Odeji's life, he rises and walks, healed, in Jesus' all-powerful name. <laughs> Unassisted and with a smile enlightening his face, Mr. John Odeji walks boldly through the church, no longer on a wheelchair. Onlookers from around the world marvel and record the miracles they witnessed happen before their very eyes. The man who was earlier brought in a car is now walking freely because of Jesus Christ. He cannot sit like this before man of God. Thank you very much. God bless you. Thank you, man of God. Thank you. Thank you, my junior brother. Thank you, man of God. Your brother need to eat. After eating, he will be able to run more than even you. Oh, man. Give him food. Thank you. With ease and joy, Mr. John Odeji stands to his feet and moves into position to share his incredible testimony. The wheelchair he once depended on has become part of his history. My name is John Odeji. On Wednesday, I came here with uh, paralysis of the body. That day, I cannot walk, I cannot even move. I have pains all over my body, my waist, my stomach, in fact, my legs. I cannot move. So, when I was brought here on that day, uh, I was brought before the man of God, uh, T.B. Joshua, and uh, he came to me on the wheelchair. I, I was uh, at uh, the emergency. He came to me, he held me at the back, where I was paining me. As he was touching me, the pain started going away gradually until he asked me to stand up and I started, I started walking. I don't have any pain over my body. I can walk now properly, as you can see. My name is Mrs. Zay Yamu. And the man here is my junior brother. I will thank God and we thank Prophet T.B. Joshua for saving us from all these problems. I was very happy that day. I really cried. 
tears of joy came out from my eyes. I will live my life uh, as, as a good Christian, and then I permit to serve God, and I sin no more. Jesus is the source of my motivation. He has given me joy in my heart. Jesus is the source of my motivation. He has given me joy in my heart. Oh, my God.